You know, I just found out today that Finland isn't even in the top 25 as it pertains to countries where skilled immigrants wish to live. Um, and that probably might surprise quite a few people who are used to seeing all the propaganda about Finland being number one, the happiest country in the world, the, the good air quality, good education, good health care. All that stuff is true. But it doesn't help that your government is currently currently completely chock full to the eyeballs with racists being led by a guy who said that he has zero tolerance for racism and yet has no problem with these bloodless, blood-sucking fucking um, um, racists all over his cabinet, all over his government. Um, and it also doesn't help that they are trying to make it harder and harder and harder and harder in the name of raising their 6 billion euros to help save Finland, which... By the way, Finland wasn't really doing all that bad financially before this. <laughs> um, in the name of that, yes, they are making things much harder for immigrants. And one of the things they're proposing, and knowing these people, it will go through, is tying immigrants' unemployment benefits into how much Finnish and Swedish they know. That's right. They're already paltry, ridiculously small unemployment benefit is going to be tied into how much Finnish or Swedish that they know. So people who have a lower proficiency in Finnish or Swedish are going to get less money uh, on top of the on top of the cuts that they're already going to make. We can't get people to live here. I fucking wonder why. It's not just some people think, "Oh, it's the it's the the, the sunrise and the sunset. It's the cold winters." It's a no. It is everything that this current racist, fascist government is making worse on a daily basis for their own people and especially, especially for immigrants. You want to know what's going to happen? Okay, now, now first of all, I don't expect, you know, Orpo or, or, or Porra or in, like, any of these motherfuckers on, on the right to know about the struggles of an immigrant because they don't care about the struggles of an immigrant. They only care about the people who are moving money, the people who got them elected in the first place, the people who they think are going to make Finland a more prosperous place, the same old tired trickle-down bullshit that's been debunked forever still lives in the hearts and minds of the politicians of Finland and is currently in use right now. What is going to happen if you start tying in yet another rider into how much unemployment benefit a, uh, an immigrant can get. If it's contingent on which language they're going to speak, they're always going to choose Swedish every time because you are now making their benefits time sensitive. They're going to go with the language that takes the least amount of time to learn, the one that's more familiar to them if they know a little bit of English. How do you think the basic Finns are going <laughs> to, you know, the Perusomalais, these, the, all of these fucking, we want everything to be Finnish and Finland for Finns only, you know, we, we just happen to be born here and, oh, well, you know, uh, this is, like, that's not going to make them happy unless they've come to some sort of concession that, okay, yeah, Swedish is an official language of Finland, so we'll, we'll, we'll just do whatever, okay. No, that's not going to make them very happy at all, and, and, Good. I don't want any of these motherfuckers to be happy for any... I, I don't want a basic Finn, the, the Petr Somalaisa, to enjoy anything in life ever, ever again. Because they are racist, they hate immigrants, and they are self-destructive towards this country. And this is self-destructive towards this country. Even if they don't all just flock to the Swedish language, it's still really, really hard to learn a second language. And when you put a timer on it like that... When you put a timer on it like that, you're not really helping matters. You're not motivating them. You're scaring them. You are, um, you know, you're coercing them into learning this language. And that is no way to help anybody. Maybe for a bunch of sociopaths like right-wingers, maybe for a bunch of bloodless sociopaths, but for, you know, people who have actual empathy, who understand the plight of an immigrant and how hard it is to learn a language... My God, Finnish is one of the, the, the hardest languages to learn in the goddamn world. And you want to put these people on a fucking stopwatch and be like, okay, well, you're going to make this much less until you get to this level. So study, study, study. These people are already fucking busy. They're already busy doing the job. You know, they're, they're already busy trying to carve out a life for themselves because you assholes are making it harder for them. Orpo, Purra, Rantanen. 
fucking uh, just, uh, I, I just this is self-destructive okay the, these policies that they want to push through are self-destructive because this is a country that this government has the aspirations of a country that is 10 times bigger than Finland and the fact is Finland just ain't 10 times bigger than it is Finland is what it is it's five and a half million people and falling five and a half million people and falling so to have aspirations like, oh, we, we, we can cut everything. We, um, we can cut all these benefits and, 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 you know, keep people's taxes the same, you know. We can cut taxes from the rich and leave everyone else's taxes the same or, or raise them. And right in the middle of inflation even, and people will be better off. <laughs> no, they won't. They're going to start leaving, jackasses. They're going to start leaving, they're already leaving, and I don't blame them because this is just, this is silly. It's silly for a government of a country this small to act so large. You're not. You're just not, and that's not an insult or anything. But, my God, do you really think that you can keep making things as hard on immigrants as you're making them and not face the consequences sooner or later for that? When you're scrambling to find people to do the jobs and, oh, well, you just can't figure it out. You can't figure it out because you never learned to try to figure it out because you're fucking racists and you're fucking neoliberals and you don't know what you're doing and you don't know how to run a country during a financially lean time. But you know what? Finland wasn't ever doing that bad to begin with. All this, we need to raise six billion euros to keep Finland solvent. F Finland was not even, they, they weren't un insolvent. They were not insolvent. Learn the difference between debt and deficit. People who are financially conservative and, and, and seek to like squeeze the most out of an economy as they can sure as fuck don't seem to know that much about economics in the first place. It's really funny, really silly, really stupid. I cannot wait for this government to fail. I cannot wait. Fuck these people. And have a good day, folks.